Good morning everyone. It's still a bit frosty at the farm and that means it's cold. And when it's cold the horses tend to be a bit fresher than usual, as you can see. <laughs> the little shits today. But anyway, let's start the training. So today we are going to start by longlining Tim and I'm going to enjoy myself with a chicken while George's doing all the hard work. It's really nice to give him a long line before I get on him. And that's purely because all of the freshness is out of him by then and he's a bit more focused and that helps me a lot when I'm riding. Speaking of riding, my main focus this week for the vlog is on Cruz. And Cruz is this nice little black cob and he's about four years old. And this is his first time in an open field like this. So with him we're just practicing hacking, getting the miles on the clock, doing some things in the school. But as you can see here, he's quite comfortable on the road. He finally dares to take the lead a bit. And I'm very proud of him. He's doing a great, great job and he seems to enjoy it. Which in my opinion is very important. And then there's another thing we usually practice with our youngsters. And that's movement on top of them. And as you can see here, I'm doing all kinds of weird stuff in a walk. Like moving my legs, touching my head, touching his bum. And all of this is to prepare them for a rider that's potentially out of balance or when they spook and you shift your weight or your leg goes forward for w whatever reason. Always practice in a walk first before you go to a trot, by the way. But this is very useful for them to get used to because you don't want your horse to freak out because of what you're doing on top of them. You want them to be chill. And last but not least, we had a loader come in to practice their loading away from home which is a service we offer when we do a call out, we go to their place and help the horse load, but then they also get an opportunity to load away from home because sometimes horses struggle with that just a bit more. And this horse is being an absolute sweetheart. We're just letting her find her own way in a bit because she does load straight on, but on a longer line, we just want them to find the solutions for themselves. And there she goes. That was it for this week. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.